Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toyota located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this new Toyota Tacoma TRD Sport Premium. Now the most suitable features on this TRD Sport Premium is its power moonroof. You also have your blind spot monitoring and your wireless charging. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this new Toyota Tacoma TRD Sport Premium. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this Sport Premium is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lamps. As you can see, you also have your hood scoop and then taking a look just over on the side, you have your 17 inch aluminum alloy wheels. You also have your integrated signal lamps, foldable mirrors and heated mirrors. And then if you take a look on the inside of the mirror, you're gonna find your blind spot monitoring indicator. Now with that indicator, it'll actually light up just looking if there is another vehicle right beside you smart key system with it so with the smart key system you can lock all the doors simultaneously just by pushing on the two lines you see there on the handle push on it once it'll lock all the doors automatically and then if you put your hand between the handle it'll unlock the front door for you as well this is all possible just as long as you do keep the key fob on you at all times and the color we're going to be taking a look at today is barcelona red now taking a closer look just at the front dash as well as the front seats you do have your black interior power driver seat with lumbar support automatic high beams as well as your auto and off switch for the rear cargo power outlet mirror controls window locks power locks and window controls now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your seek function volume control mode select as well as your voice recognition bluetooth connectivity lane departure alert cruise control and then it also comes with the push button start so all you have to do is put your foot on the brake hit the push button and it will start up for you automatically Taking a look at the multi-informational display, you'll see a couple of different features on here. So if we take a closer look, you have your fuel economy as well as your digital speedometer with a distance to empty. You can go through your compass, audio with the lane departure alert, tire pressure monitoring, messages and settings menu with the pre-collision system, lane departure alert, and a couple of other additional features as well. Taking a look at the center dash area, if you go inside your menu screen, You'll find your destination audio phone as well as a couple of other additional features. Now, it does come with the apps menu as well. So if you look inside the apps menu, it's part of the Intune app suite. So as long as you have it on your phone, you can use such apps as the Slacker app, which allows you to stream your music from your phone onto the touch panel display. You could also check on local fuel prices or on the latest sports scores, just depending on what your preferences are. Sirius XM satellite radio, dual zone climate control settings with your hazard lights, 4x4 select, Heated seat controls for your driver and passenger, blind spot monitoring on and off, as well as your ECT power, open and close for the power of your window, USB, wireless charging on and off, and power outlets. Once you have your wireless charging pad turned on, you can just place your phone on top and have it start charging for you. It's mounted to an automatic transmission. And then if you take a closer look up top, you do have the auto dimming rear view mirror with the integrated garage rubber controls. SOS connect, open and close and tilt up and down feature for the power moonroof with the sunglass case holder. And then if we take a closer look at the backup camera, as you can see, you have those nice guiding lines in there making things much easier for you when you're backing into a stall or if you're trying to hook up your trailer. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo bed as well as your tailgate. As you can see, you do have the three piece rear bumper. So in the event that you damage the one section, you just have to replace the one segment. Connectors for your towing, spare tire located underneath, and then on the back of the tailgate you have the backup camera as well as the lock for it as well. Closing in on the rear cargo bed, if you take a look over on the right hand side, you have the rear cargo power outlet. So if you're ever out of the cabin or lake during the weekend, you need to plug in your tools, you can do so. Or if you'd like, you can plug in a mini fridge or a couple of speakers. Now you do have the bed rail system in here as well, so with the bed rail system you can readjust the cleats that you see on either side, place them all on one side of the bed rail system, or take them out all together, just depending on what your needs are for. Over on your left, right, front, and back side, you're gonna find a couple of areas where you can tie down some loose cargo, just so it's not shifting around in the back of your bed, just while you're driving. Thank you so much, folks, for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Audemars Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Phone number is 780-410-2455, or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day, and I hope to see you next time.